So I started this site uh, straight out of grad school. I uh, started a design firm and we built this tool to document the things we were doing uh, professionally and personally. And it kind of it kind of started from uh, when I took up kite surfing, which is you take a giant kite and a surfboard and go get, have it drag you out in the ocean. And I started about 2000, which is kind of the infancy of the sport. So I was actually building uh, a lot of my own gear. So I'd turn up at the beach with hand-sewn kites and hand-built boards uh, and, you know, get laughed at. But half the, you know, and half the time the stuff would perform beautifully and half the time it would break spectacularly. So I'd then document everything on my own site. And pretty soon people were emailing me and asking for more information, uh, where they could find you know, similar materials, could they meet me at the beach? Uh, but they were basically asking where are similar communities building things or doing things that I'm interested in. And so I saw that there's this need for making a really easy tool to get the projects that you're passionate about up on the web and connect with people that are doing things similar to you. So right, right now there's 18 and a half thousand projects. Uh, we get maybe a thousand or so every month. Uh, and we have a bunch of contests running to encourage people to post stuff. One of the projects that really kind of brought us over the hump, this is one of the first projects that kind of uh, took off and you know, made a big deal. And so this is uh, uh, LED throwies. And what this is, is it, it's uh, an LED, a little battery, and a magnet. They're all taped together. And you, you make hundreds of these things and then you toss them up on metal surfaces as a, as a way of making art. So it's, 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 it's a glowing LED art. So it started in New York City and that's it. Yeah. So people were putting them on taxi cabs and on some of the sculptures that are, in the, in the, in, that are, that are uh, metal there. And just, you know, it kind of took off and then people started making them all over the world. And this spawned like a whole bunch of, of different types of projects. From there, I want to show you a project where it went to, which is this is this is what they call the uh, the ghetto matrix. And I'll show a video here. So what they did is they they took a ring of cameras and they have all the cameras take a picture at the same time, and it's dark, so you can get uh, you can then take an LED and you can actually outline or draw around, and then you animate all those frames. So what's happened? What you're seeing here is a bunch of frames that have been animated together uh, from all those pictures. The light on here was actually just LEDs and batteries that people came around and, and drew uh, light graffiti while the picture is being taken. So what? So they open the shutter of all the cameras. It's dark enough so you're only picking up the light, and then at the end, everybody's out of the frame and they hit him with a flash. So that's why you, and that's why you can see the guy in the center. But so that's that's the site. It, it, it's it's people sharing what they do, what they're passionate about, and connecting with other people, and then having those projects get remixed into different, bigger, better, cooler things.